Persona 5 Royal Edition. Oh wow, this is a lot. Okay, where'd this come from? How are your studies? I haven't talked to him yet. So regarding my research, do you have any time today? If you're free, I'd like to get some more input from you. Sounds like Maruki is waiting in the nurse's office. You wanna go see him? Yeah, let's just go. Because we haven't been to him yet. Seems like allergies are kicking in for everyone. You holding up okay? If you're okay with it, I'd like to get some input from you. Do you have time right now? There's no pressure, obviously, but... I feel like I can become closer with Maruki thanks to the counselor persona, Kushi Mitama. It's like my bond will grow. Hmm. Your break wouldn't be so bad. Are you going to help him? Yeah, let's help him. Let's help him out. <laughs> I just finished a counseling session and meet me in the nurse's office. Yep. Well, I'm going to walk around. Let me know when you're ready to leave. So I was recording Final Fantasy, but Final Fantasy had me fucked, so I stopped. Hmm. I've been getting all the students coming in ever since I arrived here. To be honest, it's been kind of a relief. The whole mess of Kamashita was the reason I was caught here after all. They warned me a lot of students had been impacted. I know there would be a lot of free floating anxiety. When I actually got to talk to everyone, I was pleasantly surprised. Most of the things in everyone's mind were college entrance exams, relationship problems, and other words, typical worries for high school students. Some did open up about deeper issues, but not the majority. Some students were still struggling with the scars from the incident, yes, but at the very least, I'm glad the ones who came to me have taken some steps towards recovery. Thanks to you. Well, I can only hope so. I don't think I've done much, but if I've helped even one person, then that makes it all worth it. I know I'm not the most reliable guy, but remember you can always talk to me too if something's bothering you. I am the counselor here, you know? If nothing else, I'm good at listening. Let's Having see. said that, it's a little awkward that I have to ask for your help, but you remember how I asked you to help me with my research? Of course. I said you'd be helped with my research, but don't worry, it won't be anything too difficult or intensive. I just need you to listen to what I have to say and work through some questions with me. So, but let's see, maybe I should start at the beginning. I can tell you a little about what this research is for. What I'm studying now is pain felt in the mind, or perhaps more fancifully, in the heart. Some specific examples include the pain of someone saying hurtful things to you or being separated from those you love. Maybe this would be clear pain defined by abstracts like trauma or stress. Bodily, physical pain can be thought of as something necessary, an autonomic response to injury, illness, whatever. Still. But what about pains felt within one's heart? That pain isn't born from any tangible problem in our bodies, right? It's something strange and immaterial. I guess it goes to show there are still a lot of mysteries in our own hearts and minds. You know, and I, I well, I want to learn more about these internal psychological pains. Now, this is my question to you: When do you truly feel pain in your heart? How to kick me? When someone betrays you. I see. Yes, I can sympathize there. Sometimes all it takes is one betrayal for intense trust to turn into intense pain. It can be rough. It doesn't feel good to struggle with pain in your heart. For example. But with that in mind, how about the pain of a broken heart then? After all, that kind of pain is only born because we fall in love, right? Do you have any thoughts on this kind of pain, Happy Cake Moon? Um, that one seems necessary. We better off that way. It's a seed for Nessie. It's a seed. Haha, ha, ha. I never took you for a poet, but it's a wonderful sentiment, a very positive way of looking at it. Internal emotional pain can be difficult to deal with, though some say it's always coupled with other feelings. And I agree. Of course, I think that's a fair assessment, though personally speaking, I think if pain can be avoided, it should be. Maybe it shouldn't exist at all. Hmm. Wounds of the heart are much harder to detect, and in a way, they're far more complex than physical injuries. That's why I'm doing this research, to save people who are suffering from internal pain they keep holding on to. You helped me realize that purpose again. Thank you. How about, don't worry about it. Right. Thanks to you, I think I'll be able to better articulate my thoughts today. I can sense Maruki's gratitude towards me. Yay, bonding! Rank up! Chance to receive the effects of charge and concentrate at the start of battle. Alright. More stunts! <clears throat> okay, I think that'll do for today. Oh? Hmm, why do I feel like I'm forgetting something? <gasps> Your mental training. Oh, uh, no, I didn't forget about our promise, of course. I'll teach you tricks for mental discipline, and you help me with my research. That's what you decided, right? Now then, how about something like this today? 
Thanks to my rookie's mental training, my mind feels stronger. All right. Oh, that's cool. Oh, and here, never a bad time for a snack, right? Jagariko. Well, see you. Okay, now we're ready to wrap things up. Oh, this is Motoriki. Do you have time to talk right now? I'm taking a breather. Just finished my last counseling session for the day, and I thought I'd thank you once again for your help earlier. Um. Thanks. A lot of students came by to talk today. Hopefully, they got something out of it. But to be honest, it's pretty tough juggling this job and my research at the same time. Thanks again for agreeing to help me out. I might be looking. To you for help more frequently from now on, it'd mean a lot if you could lend a hand. Alright, see you later. Ah, you're back. Yo. Hey. What did you get? Stronger list? Oh yeah, I forgot I did order something the day before. Damn. Oh. Must see what you are for me. Offered. Must be what you ordered off the TV. Uh, you got anything, Sojito? Yeah. Don't trust you too easily. When push comes to shove, they're all stabbed in the back. You hear? Indeed. Can confirm. Um. I hate the batting cages. I feel like, in general, though, like. People really. People really be tripping. Oh, I might be able to go to the airsoft shop now. No, I don't have. No, no, I can't. Big Bang Burger. I think I need more guts, right? I need more guts to be able to do the thing. Actually, we're gonna go to the airsoft. We're gonna go to the airsoft shop and see if I can talk to him about the thing. Hmm. Like, what the bag? Dauntless Judge. Okay. Fine. I need my I need my guts up, so let's go to Big Bang Burger. Excuse me. Do the challenge. Okay, we've seen this already. Take the challenge. 500 um. yen. Second mate, the difficulty of the missions increase, 500 yen, take the challenge. Certainly. So as I was saying earlier, I was playing Final Fantasy earlier and I just kept dying and I just couldn't Thank do you very it. Much. I had to quit. This is your foe. It looks like Whoa. the same thing, doesn't it? This is the gravity burger, a burger so large that it almost has its own gravitational field, okay. Once again, this would be no easy feat to overcome, but you should. But should you conquer this challenge, you'll be rewarded with an extravagant prize. So this one comes with a prize too. Do your best. Now then. Thirty minute challenge. Where'd he go? He's gonna eat like a quarter of it or a half or something. Mm hmm. Mm. That's good, but it's so big. Oh, oh half. Man. More courage. You need guts, knowledge, and proficiency? Shit. Yep. Okay. That's exciting. Still bold. Wow. Okay. That's fine. This is never gonna. It's just never gonna. Oh, school day. Oh, we can read! Let's read something. Let's read. Guess we're finishing the Buchiko story. Turn up. Mm -hmm. After his death, the statue of Buchi became a symbol of Shibuya. Mm -hmm. Buchiko, the story about this dog makes me cry every time. And it's done. What are your thoughts? So you finished reading Buchiko's story. A dog who kept waiting for his master in Shibuya, huh? A noble and loyal friend to the end. I have to admit, the story moved me. Can't you feel can't you feel it warm your heart mm -hmm. too? Still inoffensive. Over oh, arms at the station, I'd say that was an efficient use of your time. Turn up. 
Welcome to school, y'all. Are we gonna fast forward through lunchtime? Oh shit. All right, let's begin. I need to look up the answers. Oh god. First, I'm gonna ask about an upcoming school event. As part of a seed beautification project, the entire school will be participating in a public cleanup campaign. That means we're going to Inokashida Park to pick up trash. Okay, quiet down. Settle down. The cleanup will take place next week on the 30th. All students are to wear their gym uniforms during the event, so don't forget to dress the part. You guys hear about this cleanup bullshit in Inokashida Park? I guess it's the principal's idea. Damage control after Kamashita scandaled up the school's rep. Pretty sure scandal is not a verb. But I get what you mean. Even the counselor stuff seems like a desperate move. It's all annoying. Oh, oh. All the girls in our class have been freaking out over this new guy, too. I've been hearing Maruki's hot, kind, censored. Basically, everyone thinks he's their type. Whoa, I guess he's pretty popular then. Oh, yeah? Did you guys go to his counseling yet? Oh shit, I forgot. But I don't know, I don't really feel like going, you know what I mean, right, Kai? He's a good counselor. Ah, uh, keep reading the question next. Whoa, really? You should just go already. If you're slacking and you don't attention to us, we're the ones who have to pay for it. Fine. Oh, good, no questions. That wasn't prepared. After school! It's open. Come on in. What's up? What's up? Hey there. Takamoto kun, here for a counseling session? Well, it's not like I wanted to or nothing. Ah, sorry you were forced into this, but anyway, come in, come in. So, this is pretty awkward. Uh -huh. Oh, why is that? I mean, I don't really go see teachers unless they want to chew me out for doing something wrong. Oh, I'm not a teacher here. If anything, well, I'm here to be on the student side. <sighs> oh, yeah? So, am I supposed to tell you about Kamashita now? Well. Oh, no, no. This isn't some kind of interrogation. You're free to just kick back and talk about whatever you want. Like. What? How about it? Mm, how about. Is there anyone in your class that you like? Uh, That's not that exactly easy to talk about either, and it's not like there is anybody. Uh, sorry. uh, oh, sorry, I just meant you're in the middle of your teenage years, and alright, high schoolers are just discovering romance and all, so is that how it went for you? Not exactly, <laughs> but um, that's just because I fell in love with my studies first. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry, I'm supposed to be hearing you out. But instead, I'm just bringing down the room. Oh, how about this instead? What do you do? What do you do in your free time? To Kamato Kun on the weekend after school? Uh, uh hanging with my buds mostly. But I just started doing that recently. Before that, I was just pissed all the time. Even before that, I was only all about the track team. Ah. So, is your leg better now? Oh, so you know about that too. Well, yeah, pretty much. So long as I don't strain it or nothing. I see. Quite. You really do enjoy running, don't you? Guess so. I mean, after all that training I did, it makes sense I'd like it. I'd be training constantly, getting sweet, getting sweet times at meets along with everyone else. Eventually, I was gonna get my hands on some running scholarships to make it easier on my mom. But all of that's <sighs> in the past now. That's cool though. I got way more important shit to do now. More important, huh? <laughs> well, no matter what path you might have to might have to take to get there, I hope your track dreams will still do you some good in the end. Y yeah. Ah, thanks. I know. And you know what they say, right? If you wish hard enough, your dreams can come true. What the uh, hell? You trying you trying to sell me some kind of line now? Oh no, this is actually a genuine phenomenon with a lot of research going into it even now. Look at it this way, Sakamoto Kun. What do you want most out of life right now? Um <sighs> I want something to drink, I guess. <gasps> huh? Uh, what? I looked into a coupon for a free can of apple juice at the convenience store this morning, and now I'd like for you to have it. Thanks. <laughs> See, your wish came true. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, Dr. Maru, uh, I mean, Doc, anyone ever tell you you're kind of not normal? 
You think so? Huh, that, could that be a compliment coming from you? Uh, no? <laughs> uh oh. Awkward. Um, let's see. What did everyone else do? Time with An, Takan, Takemi, Ryuji, Trial by Burger, Thievery. Went to the palace. Hours level 18. I don't even know what fucking level I am. Honestly, at this rate, we might as well just fucking go. Let's go to the fucking Ido. Might as well. Everyone's here. I won't hold on to take legal action against us. We'll change his heart for sure. Hold meeting. I need like potions and shit. Guess we'll find out when we get there. All that shit about Madarame taking legal action seriously ain't funny, you guys. There's still some time. There's still time to spare. We probably don't want to take too much longer. Okay. We should it's sort through our current state of affairs. How are we progressing to the palace? We're going at a pretty solid pace. We should be okay as long as we don't get carried away. What do we want to do about the shadows? It'd be real bad if any of them caught us. Think we should try avoiding them for now or something? I believe we're adequately strong at this point. All of our training was worth That's it. it That's that about meeting. the size of it. Okay, so we're good. Let's infiltrate. All right. I'm gonna bust loose. It's been so long since I've played that I genuinely don't... Like, I genuinely don't know where I am. Yeah. We haven't decided, we haven't on, decided the new on the new code recruit's name code name. Oh, whoops. It has to be Kitsune. You know, with that Kitsune mask and everything. Hell yeah. That really leaves an impression. Are you talking about me? No. What do you want your name over here to be? I'd say Da Vinci. Uh -uh. Nope. Well, you've got that mask like On said. And Come there's furry. that weird tail. All right, you're Abu Rage. <laughs> Very well. He's agreed to it? It's decided then. Abu Rage. Nuh uh, not happening. Do you have any ideas, Joker? Let's just do Fox. <laughs> oh, just keep it literal, huh? Sounds good to me. What do you think, Fox? It's acceptable. It's set then. Let's go. I don't even remember our names. By the way, we should have Joker decide who our starting lineup is from here on out. Starting lineup? You mean the ones who will be going in first? Yeah. Now that Fox has joined us, it'll be harder to move around as a group. We'll stand out more, too. Considering how we've operated to this point, we should have four starters. Anyone else can be backup. And I guess we always gotta have our leader with us, right? Exactly. That's why we'll have Joker choose the remaining three. And what should the backup do? Would it be best for them to stay outside of the palace? No. They should come in as well, but maintain a reasonable distance from the main group. In other words, the starting lineup is the first wave of our infiltration force. Well, we'll leave the team composition to you, Joker. I don't know. I want my homie Ryuji. Joker! I want the new kid. May I get a word in? And then sorry to cause you trouble. We'll bring on because I don't want Morgana right now. Hey. Thanks. Cool. And then what's up? No. Hmm. Yeah. Excuse me. Well, that's it, right? Can I just fast travel here? Yeah, I'm just gonna fast out to the central garden and go from there. We've arrived. So what do we do now? Right, what do we do now? Hey. Um, we have to change Mario's heart. <sighs> Put that thing straight. Let's press onward. Where are we at right now? Well. Talk to the team. What do you wanna talk about? How's our progress? Hey. Where where are we at now? I think we reached halfway point. There's no knowing what lies ahead of us. This is the perfect chance for Fox to show us his skills. Yes. Our resolve has not wavered, so I will certainly give this my all. What are your thoughts? Is there anything else you want to discuss? 
Museum exploring, I suppose. Shall we go? So let's get going then. Okay, out the door. Let's go. Um, I genuinely don't. Wasn't that big guy up here or some shit? Right? Like, are we supposed to go this way? Cause the alarm's not. Yeah. Sweet, the security's still down. <sighs> Thanks to all my hard work. Huh? What do you mean by that? Don't worry about it. Come on, let's go. Well, let's keep going. Sorry. Oof. Oh, there's stairs on the side. Oh, they're fake stairs. Well, ain't that just a bitch? Oh, there's a, there's a, there's a big guy. We already did the computer thing. We might have to fight him, and I really don't want to fight him. But, uh. I don't think there's a way to avoid. Honestly, when he goes that way. Shadow spotted. It's powerful, so let's be. That brochure. Oh, oh yeah, that could be another pamphlet. Let's take it with us, Joker. Sure. Oh, it's a new map. Hey, ain't this pamphlet different from the one we got before? You're right. It says it's the second out of two. Oh, we have both of them. Yes. Oh, and it has the rest of the map. Now we can use it to figure out where the treasure is, right? I suspect it's in the innermost point of this place. If that's the case. The most suspicious spot seems like this main hall here. It looks like. Hmm, we will need to pass through the lounge and the gallery in order to reach it. The deeper in we go, the tighter security is going to be. We need to advance carefully, okay? I mean... Let's go left. Oh, I don't even have any lights to do Oh great, doesn't need luck picks. Revival be it even better. Okay. Well now we go right. You can see me, but you can't get to me. And that's that's the key. Okay. Hey, I see a shadow. Be careful. Don't they? Oh well, you don't worry about him. Locked door with shadow inside. Okay. Shadow is near. Take caution. Yeah, but the shadows are, like, inside this fucking room. And I can't- I don't know how... Joker! It feels like I might touch the max and let's be careful as we go through here, okay? Joker! There's a chest! Right. I don't want to just... Homeboy doesn't come this far over, does he? I don't think he does. Yeah, he don't. I'll reveal your true form. Yeah. That worked out. That was not about to do the other thing. Now's our chance to strike. Go! Um... Let's just attack... Let's rush it and see what happens. Okay. Child's play. Chest I can't get to. Because there's things covering them. There's also the that guy over there. Who I also can't get to. Actually, I can get to him. I'd have to go under. I'll reveal your Boom. true form. Turn up. And rush. You 
sir. Let's talk. What you got? Um, give me some. Give me an item. I thought we'd be together forever. Can't we get? Can't we get back together? Let's negotiate. I didn't ask for this. That's true. Was it items you wanted? Take it. Lifestone. Okay. I can't hold it back when you give me those puppy eyes. It's almost time for me to head to a different job. Thanks for letting me go. Cool. Well, on that note, I'm gonna end this part right here. The next part, we're going to finish, or not finish. We're gonna figure out, um, level up. Cool. We're gonna figure out all of these lasery right. things and go from there. Uh, so like, comment, and subscribe. Thank y'all for all the support. Y'all are the best. I appreciate each and every one of you. Um, but, uh, you know the drill. I'm out this bitch.